We got some hope from home. Very, very good. We'll show it to you in just a second. We're talking about tire shake. But right now, we are talking T.J. Zizzo and Terry McMillan. McMillan, who you saw earlier, carrying the memorial on the side of his car. Zizzo is in a tenth for McMillan. You see his onboard camera. This is his time to get in. Hey, let's go Ultramo and talk tire shake, Mike. Well, tire shake can be from one of two things. If it's not enough wheel speed, it can go into tire shake. Or if it's just a little bit too much when you try to apply the clutch, you get that little tire rattle. You saw the tires cup at the bottom before they went up into the tire smoke on Morgan Lucas's car here. Obviously, they missed, missed the setup. They'll have to go back and review that data to see what caused it because there's two different uh, fixes for that one. You got to come in and make the car accelerate faster. The other one, you may have to slow it down just a little bit. T.J. Zizzo back his sixth race at Indy. First race here in 2004. Three round wins in his career, and you saw the signatures on the car. Mike, did they race yours already? I hope so. Oh, you're getting no respect <laughs> out of the guys. I tell you, it's a great promotion, though, that uh, T.J. came up with on this car, and I'll tell you, the car's been running well, too. I mean, it's been going down the racetrack, running consistent. As he said, he's currently in that number 10 spot with a 385 elapsed time, so he's definitely got a high rod. Now, as you go on board with Terry McMillan, as you said, needs to get into this show. He's got to run quicker than a 560 elapsed time. This car has run a number of times in the low 390 range uh, this season, so we know it's capable of doing it, just no matter whether they got the setup right. See the revs? Right there on the uh, LED display, the dash display, McMillan. He's oh. up in smoke. Oh. Wow. And so is Zizzo. Zizzo, though, at least he is in. McMillan, he's not. He only has one more session, and it's supposed to be a little warmer later. Well, coming up next, we're going to have ESPN College Football presented by Five Hour Energy for you. Tulsa, that's my old alma mater, by the way, and East Carolina. And then after the football, we've got so many great stories. Tony Pedragon, he's not in the funny car field. Tony Schumacher trying to put himself in a position to go to his unprecedented ninth win. And Ashley Force Hood, can she get her first win of this year? She's the defending champion here. We'll have coverage of the end of this qualifying session and then the fifth session when we come back at five o'clock the oil downs uh, took a little time away from all of us in our live coverage here